Good morning. It's uh, Wednesday morning here in Cypress, Texas. Nice, perfect. We should just stay this way all day. Yeah. Had a... Took a lot of notes last night. Um, during the teaching. There, uh... Michael, Michael is changed. Michael, um, he's, uh, he's more refined than when I first met him, just like two years ago, you know, which is, I'm thinking that I'm, I'm gonna give I'm gonna give Rachel some credit to that for that, right? Women got a way of doing that to you, softening you up, smoothing you out. That's a better word. Smoothing you out. The uh, but I'll tell you what, he's got me understanding um, how. <laughs> how the there's something in um, money laundering you have to do continuing education all the time and anti-money laundering is part of your continuing education and it's uh, layering how they mix uh, how they mix uh drug money in with legitimate money and it's kind of how they how they've got the uh, the mysteries interwoven in the different books of the Bible between the Old Testament um, you know the first five books of the Bible and then uh in the prophets, and then, uh, and then the Gospels, and then the writings of Paul. Now, if I didn't know what I know now, I would still not understand what's going on in Paul's letters. But... I've actually had people tell me that the jury's still out on whether Paul's an actual apostle. And those are the ones that are hard set that you're not an apostle unless you were one of the twelve. But there's like so much overwhelming evidence that that the apostles were were, were developed by those first twelve way on, you know, continuously throughout the Bible and past since then, right, the early church fathers and, and all of that. And, uh, but Michael does a really good job of helping you unshuffle and, and put together you know, where, you know, you, you, you totally unlocks like the revelations, right? You understand what they're talking about. You know, John the Revelator's really saying the same things that the prophets did in the Old Testament. Oh, yeah. And then how Christ is revealed in the Old Testament. So you gotta know the Old Testament. Alright. I think I said what I need to say. Have a good day.